Entrepreneurship is one of the most challenging journeys you can take. The vast majority of people think that for a business to succeed, what you need is a great idea and a great product to market fit. But in reality, that's not true. An idea remains just an idea if you cannot raise financing. Why are some entrepreneurs able to take their business idea and convert that into a super successful company, a unicorn that is valued at more than $1 billion? Entrepreneurs, to be successful, need to understand financing. But that is not a given. What our results show is that going through the process of due diligence teaches entrepreneurs the key questions that investors will ask, the things that they're looking for to get excited for an investment. Here at the LSE, you're going to learn how to raise financing, how much, at which terms, when, and from which types of investors. I look at the impact of due diligence by seed funds on entrepreneurs, and also the impact of participating in business accelerators. I go out of the classroom and I talk to investors and entrepreneurs, and I get unique data that is very difficult to find otherwise because it's not available in the public domain. And based on that data, I get insights that then I can teach you in our class. The training that entrepreneurs receive, both through due diligence with seed funds, as well as by participating in business accelerators, make them more successful and grow fast. How to interact with investors, how to think better about financing, when to raise financing, from whom, and at which stage of your company. High growth companies typically raise financing from sources you may not be used to, nor your families. These are not the typical banks that provide loans to individuals. These are instead specialized pools of money that only invest in early stage entrepreneurs. In my class, you will get an unfair advantage because you will understand the ecosystem, how to talk to investors, how to think about your company, and understand the importance of financing, how much to raise, when to raise it, and from which types of investors.